Here is a shortcut formula for computing the population covariance. If x and y are random variables, again nothing is indicated here whether they are discrete or continuous, so this is good for both. With finite populations means mu sub x and mu sub y respectively, then the covariance of x and y, which is given by the defining formula, the expected value of the product of x minus mu x and y minus mu y, can be calculated as the expected value of x y minus the mean of x times the mean of y. Here is the proof. Start on the left hand side here with the defining formula of the covariance with a little bit of algebra. You can get to this first step. All that has been done here is the um, argument in the expected value operator has been simply multiplied out. The second step using a couple properties of the expected value. You may remember from earlier that the expected value of a sum is the sum of the expected values. So in this particular case we get four different terms. Now the first one is the expected value of xy. In the case of the uh, second term here, which has been moved actually over here, what you have is you have mu sub x coming out front as a constant. And on this term right here, the negative and the mu sub y come out front. And then finally, the expected value of mu sub x, mu sub y. Well, the mean of x and the mean of y are both constants, so the expected value of a constant is a constant. Finally, the expected value of x is mu sub x, and the expected value of y is mu sub y. So ignoring the signs, these last three terms here are all mu sub x times mu sub y. So for example, we could cancel these last terms. That's just a little bit of algebra. And when you do so, this is mu sub x, mu sub y, and that proves the shortcut formula. Sometimes the shortcut formula will be slightly quicker than the defining formula for particular distributions.